Hey guys, welcome back to more AFK Arena. In today's video, we're going to be doing Walker's Bountiful Trials or Arena of Trials. Uh, like always, I will leave timestamps to the battles each boss. Um, if you do have trouble with any bosses, let us know in the comments. We can help out and get some things done. But it should be fine because we are on this Chapter 7 account. So hopefully the scaling doesn't change for anyone and we can all get through with the same teams that I use. But anyway, let's get into it. Okay, so first up, standard rewards, nothing's changed here. Let's jump in and see what we can do. Now, I have been struggling to use this guy, so hopefully we can actually get through this not too hard. <laughs> we'll have to wait and see. So, what do we got here? So, we do have Taylene, we got Rowan, we got plenty of sustain, which I feel like is the way he was intended to be used, but I just feel like he doesn't do enough damage. Like, I feel like he's meant to have a bunch of sustain on his team, and then away you go. I think we might put Taylene there to just bait that. Um, after that, we can probably go with Hendrick to protect that back row and a Rosaline. Um, I think this will actually work okay. I think this will work okay. Link Hendrick to Taylene. Doesn't matter if Taylene dies and takes that extra damage, it should be fine. Walker's going to ult really quick. He does ult really quick, though. I'm curious to see the damage after this one. Um, I just feel like we got enough sustain, and then he can just do the damage with the Rosaline follow, and we should be fine. Ooh, Hendrick getting getting shot at. Hendrick just getting bullied. Rip, I think we're done here. I think we're done. Didn't bring enough damage. Like I said, he just doesn't do enough damage. Uh, we might be okay. We might be okay. Yeah, they got a lot of sustain. I, we definitely needed to bring more damage. Oh, there we go. He, he's actually killing things now. He's killing things. Nice. Nice. Okay, that took a long time. Okay, he needed to ramp up a little bit. Like, obviously, he's going to deal all the damage there. But, like, you look at the Rose Lane. Like, I just don't think the guy's damage is there. But anyway, that is the winning formation. Let's collect that and let's move on. He just... Okay, so that formation didn't work, so we're, we're going to mix it up here. Uh, let's see what we can bring. I feel like the chicken works well with him, actually, so he can actually just punt them um, and just nuke the whole lot of them. So let's do something like that. Let's get Rowan in there for the stuns. Um, and then I feel like we've got enough sustain. We can just put Respin in there for the extra damage. Hopefully Respin just one-shots that Shamira. See what happens. He's going to ult here. Everyone's grouped up, so he should be just spreading that damage nicely. They do have the twins. We're about to roll an ult here. Shamira ulted, but if we can kill Shamira, we're good. If we can kill Shamira, we're good. We got her stun. She's going around in the swirly dirlies. Yes, I just made up a word. Leave me alone. <laughs> okay, yeah, we've got this. We, we should have this. Brutus go down. Yeah, nice. Okay. Walker, how'd you go? Yeah, he did die, but man, his damage is not... Considering he has no... Like, he, he really doesn't bring much to the table. Makes me sad, because he's so such a cool dude. Makes me really sad. Okay. Uh, what do we got here? So, I feel like he works well with, um, with Ulna. So, like, that's... Like, I feel like Ulna's, like, a prerequisite for him. Uh, we could just use this as well. So, we could use him just to take out the, uh, the twins... Um, and Athalia to take him out. And I think this is, I mean, it looks pretty balanced. Like, hopefully we win. We got a pretty, pretty nice team. I think. Okay, Euron's almost dead. Yep. Okay. We're going to get stunned here. And then my round's, round's going to pop. And then Ulna's going to do her scream. I still wish Ulna's wolves would come in at some stage. Makes me really sad that too. Just a sad day. <laughs> Walker just not doing much. Opening up old wounds of Olna not bringing wolves. It's just it's completely sad. Hopefully we can kill that Mezoth, by the way. He's taking zero deeps. Turtle's surviving pretty well in the back there, too. Yeah, surely we got Mezoth. Let's go, let's go. Mezoth was way cooler when he ate people. Am I the only one that thinks that? Wow, he's actually going to beat us. He's actually going to beat us. We cannot deal any damage to this guy. We're dealing zero. We're doing, doing zero deeps, man. It's bad. Okay, okay, we got him. Hopefully he doesn't time us. Man, that Mez are thick as. Thick as, but we got him. Okay, nice. Apologies two times speed because we're on the early account. We can't do the four times. Uh, let's go to the next one, but you guys can just skip around anyway. It's all good. 
Uh, where's the next boss at? There it is. Let's go. I think this is number four, I think. Okay, so this one involves a mega tilt warning. This has been the longest amount of attempts that I've ever done on one of these. So I'm hoping this one works at the time of recording this. I think I'm up, I'm, I think I'm about 30 attempts on this one. We're even, we're recruiting the Peggy for this one. We cannot kill the Orthros. Walker cannot deal damage and he has no, he brings nothing to the table. The dude is just, I'm just really sad about Walker. Yes, not having power creep is nice, but Come on, it just makes getting my my purple stone an absolute nightmare. Like trying to do this. Dude, I've spent I was, I reckon I've spent like 15, 20 minutes here. And and the killer is that this account doesn't have four times speed, so it's been just a slow, miserable <laughs> wail away for the last I don't even know how long this has taken. Okay, we got the Orthros down. Okay, we've got it. We've got it. Finally. Peggy was the key to this one. I tried it so many times with everything else. Uh Peggy. Peggy, my hero. Peggy, my absolute hero. Okay. Okay. What? Peggy's a beast. <laughs> I didn't realize Peggy did that much damage. Look at Walker. What an absolute trash unit. Peggy's way better. Okay. Oh, thank God that is done. Like literally, these things normally take me like 10 minutes to make these things. <laughs> I've spent, I think I'm up to like 40 minutes sitting here. All right, let's go to this one. Next battle. Let's, let's hopefully this is a bit easier. Note to self, Peggy. Okay, take two of this one. We're taking Peggy because she's OP as we found out last fight. We're taking Respons for some extra damage because Walker can't do any. We've got Nara for the counter of the Blinder. Rowan because he's good and Walker because he's a crippling unit that just we're forced to take into this thing and it tilts me. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. All right. All right. Rowan's dead. That sucks. Respin hit that actually decent damage out of that Respin. Not bad. Now I got a kill. Walker's dead. Yeah, we, we should have this. Okay, nice, nice. Got it in two. Got it in two. Still, still, man, that's painful. Okay, collect that. Yoink. Last one, I think. I think this is the last one. I've been here for a long time. I'm an old man by now. We'll do that. Uh, well, let's just let Nara take him because he's trash anyway and we don't really have any use for him. Let's see, let's see. Okay, killing the Taylene ain't optimal, but we are going to stun the twins here, which is good. We got the... Yes, we got her down. Twins dead. Nice. Okay, Taylene Thorin. We should get this. We should definitely have this. Boom. Respin, my man. Good work. Good, good work. Got it done. I'm curious on damage. Respin and Peggy doing some deeps. Maybe I have to revisit Peggy. Maybe I have to revisit Peggy. Okay, let's go over there and collect. And job is done. <laughs>